I explained in my previous video about SEM or fuel emission scanning electron microscope uh, analysis. It gives us information about the morphology, the dimension, the shapes, whether the shapes look like a spherical ball, whether the shape look like hollow, whether the shape look like a nanofiber, whether it look like a nanotube, or it look like a blocks, or it look like a cubes. So it always give information about morphology and particularly about the surface morphology. It only scan the surface. It is not going inside the material. When electron going inside the material, that we call transmission electron microscope. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to measure the thickness. And when we zoom it, zoom it, so you know this is uh, this layer is a very very thin layer you see it is in micron so now we are going to show you that when you have a nanostructure material and you want to make a paste a paste mean uh, something like a paint and when you prepare a paste that is called a paint like when you are painting the wall so when we prepare paste we just uh, put on the FTO that is the glass FTO the below one you see here this big wall this is, this is the glass FTO fluorine uh, tin oxide doped tin oxide this is glass and we make a glass a conducting material by doping with uh, uh, I, uh, indium tin oxide or tin oxide doped tin oxide so these are the nanofibers here let, let me see here so you can easily um, uh, measure the uh, thickness of the a layer so this is the 10 micron here you see when you take this 10 micron and you take it this into vertical so it is almost 30 you see here and this machine also give us 30 almost you see so this scale is very very powerful this scale give you a lot of information about uh, how to measure the size of a material size of a thickness or something you see here so if you don't have MJ and if the examiner asks you during the interview or um, during the defense that uh, if these bars are not there, uh, for instance, and if they ask you something like this, then what do you guess about the, 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 the dimension, the, the, the thickness of this layer? So you can usually say, sir, uh, so if you take this one now, this is almost, and if you take this computer, this is almost 30 in the micrometer. Uh, he will ask, she will ask how, you know, you ask that from this scale, I know. So this scale is almost 10. So if you multiply this with 3, so it will almost uh, showing you the thickness view. You see? Now let's zoom and further zoom it here. You see here, here the thickness is increasing here. You see? Now so I told you that you get a lot of information. Now this is a thickness in, in previous it was almost uh, about uh, 10 micron, uh, the 20 micron here and 29 micron here. But if you look into here, so it, it decreasing, it decreasing tremendously. Don't see that it looks like big because we increase the scale. <laughs> but you see, there it was almost 30 micron, and here is 18 micron or 20 micron. So our thickness is not smooth here. So this information you can get from scanning electron microscope. Previously, uh, if you look into the thickness of the layer uh, using your naked eyes. So you don't know whether the, the layer is uniform or not, but here you can clearly see that the layer is not uniform here, you see here. And we further zoom here, you see here, the now you can see the fibers, very, very nice. This means that when you grind, when you grind the nanofibers, you cannot finish the, the, the or break the shape here, you see here, the shapes are there. Uh, we just think that it will be just like a flowers, but it's not like that. You see here, it is very very clear. And this is the 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 the, the top level of the of the of this uh, layer here. You see here, so you can easily see the fibers here. You see the fibers are there. That is mean that you cannot uh, finishes the nanofibers here. You see the fibers are still there nanofibers. So this is how uh, you use scanning electron microscope to know about the morphology, the layer morphology and all information about uh, nanostructure material. Thanks for watching.